This is Mike Callahan, Dr. File Finder, and welcome to your Butter Session Time tutorial on how you can study the stars on your Android phone with Google Sky Maps. Sky Maps is free, it's available in the Android market. Just go in and download it. I have it here in my droid. I'll tap on the icon. See, Google Sky Maps starts to load. And then it begins to show you the stars and the constellations. I'll tap on the menu key, tap on settings, and you have a number of settings that you can deal with. Sky gradient, whether you want to see stars, constellations, Messier objects, planets, have a ascension and declination grid, see the horizon line, and so on. Probably one of the most important things is down here, the location. We'll tap on that. You can see it has the option to always use GPS. Now, if you want, you can set the location manually by entering a place like a name of a town or putting in the latitude and longitude if you know it exactly. But for most people, using the GPS will work just fine. So we'll set that, then we'll go back. And now we're seeing the stars as they would appear above my house if I could see them because it's daytime. Another cool feature, tap the menu button and tap toggle night mode. And this is a cool effect, and I tested it out in the dark, is that it helps you to see the display better when you're out at night using sky maps to study the stars. You can move the constellations around. If you tap lightly over by the left-hand side, you get this display where you can toggle off and on different things that you toggled in the menu. So you don't have to go all the way back in. You can tap this, tap on the thing, and have it disable grid lines layer. You can have it disable Messier objects. So in this way, you can see the display gradually becomes more clear. If I disable the constellations layer, then I'm able to see stars more clearly because I don't have all the lines that are joining them. So this is a great way to study the stars for yourself, for your children, for your grandchildren. And you can also tap search, and you can search for a particular star, like Mars, for example, which is obviously a planet. So this is Google Sky Maps on your Android phone, and that's all there is to it. 